Today I'm going to be removing an under-the-counter Magic Chef motor, um, carousel motor. I want to test it out to see if it's working. And this is electrical, so before you start working, please make sure you unplug your machine. This one's already taken down off the counter, but the first thing I'm going to do is take out the roller support and the plate. And then I'm going to tip this one on its back. And there's several, several screws I'm going to remove. Now the next step, there were actually only three screws across the top of this one, so this one's actually kind of easy to get to. The whole panel dropped down. If you're working underneath your stove, above your stove, uh, this would be actually a simple one to get to. There's one screw here that you're going to undo, and the coupler is still on the inside, which attaches to the microwave plate, so that'll drop off when I pull this. This one's slotted, so we spin, pull, and then what I'll do is I have some wire leads to an on-off switch. Um, I'll plug this into that, um, and I directly plug that into the wall. These are typically 120, yeah, AC 120 volt. So I will hook that up, turn the power on, and then I'll test to make sure it cycles correctly and in both directions. I'm just going to use this. Um, instead of my on off switch, I have my motor down here, I have it plugged in. Um, benefit here is I don't have to touch anything, so I push it in to turn the power on, and it's cycling clockwise, and now it's going in the counterclockwise direction. So this is a good motor. And turn it off, unplug my wires, turn my power back on again, and that's how I test my motor.